hello and welcome back to my channel i know it's been a little minute since you've heard my voice but i am back with another video and in today's video i'll be showing you how to download free procreate brushes that you can find straight off of google and import it straight into procreate pro so if you would like to see how i get these brushes just continue watching The easiest way to find free brushes is to simply type in free procreate brushes and as you can see there's a bunch of links that pop up as for me i tend to go for things that correlate to what i'm looking for so if i'm looking for procreate brushes i would look on the procreate site or any kind of discussion boards because usually with places like that you tend to find the products that you need if you get what i'm saying Once you find the link that you're looking for, something that you're interested in, usually what works for me so far, and I literally just figured out how to do this, but I use Dropbox links. Anything else, I'm pretty sure you probably have to use your laptop for, and I'm pretty sure you can get the brushes for it, but if you want to download it directly off of your iPod, I suggest to find links that will let you do that directly. As for me, I found Dropbox links, and instead of trying to download it, to a Dropbox account, which I'm pretty sure I don't have, I decided to directly download it using its website. And once I did that, you can open it using Procreate and then it'll actually take you to the Procreate app. So I decided to do to make things faster for me, I split my screen, which is when you swipe up from the iPad Pro and then you drag whatever app over to the side and it'll split the screen. And when you do that, you get the brush kind of faster because you don't have to like switch back and forth between apps it's right there on the screen and you can test it out and see if you like it like for most of these brushes there's a preview already there there's like mini artwork clip arts that'll show you what the brush does but for the brushes that don't have it if you just want to try it out and see if it works or not you can do it that way importing your heart's content basically then that's where the real fun begins and you can go back to procreate test out the brushes and see what works for you and see what doesn't work and just experiment with like different art styles so i really hope you guys found this useful as i learn the app more and as i do more research i will share with you guys what i've learned if you like what you've seen today please be sure to like comment and subscribe thank you and have a nice day